Grunfeld Defense, Exchange, Modern Exchange Variation, 7, C58.RB1009.B2CXD410.CXD4QA5 plus 11.BD2 XA212.OOBG413.BG5. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. Both players navigated the middle game well. The Reedy is a less common but flexible opening that controls the center with the knight before committing a pawn. G6 prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop on G7, where it will sit on the long diagonal. In addition to controlling the E5 and C5 squares and giving the dark squared bishop room to grow, D4 takes up space in the center. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. C4 obtains room in the middle and on the queen side and gets ready to advance the knight to C3. As a result, the bishop grows and gains flexibility on the long diagonal. The d5 and e4 squares are under the control of nc3, which advances the knight into the center. The light squared bishop can advance and the c4 pawn is attacked when d5 occupies space in the center. This exchange is fair. Nx d5 recaptures the d5 pawn, centralizes the knight and allows the dark squared bishop to attack the d4 pawn. This strikes a rival knight. It is a fair deal after all captures. Backs off. C5 takes space in the center and attacks the d4 pawn, if white captures the c5 pawn then black can reply with bx c3 plus, winning the exchange. Rb1 develops the rook to a half open file and puts pressure on the b7 pawn. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. B2 develops the bishop and prepares castling. CXD4 opens up the center, captures the d4 pawn and attacks the c3 pawn. CXD4 recaptures the pawn and controls the e5 and c5 squares. QA5 plus develops the queen, puts white in check and attacks the a2 pawn. BD2 develops the bishop, gets white out of check and attacks the black queen. XA2 captures a pawn and moves the attacked queen. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. BG4 develops the bishop and attacks the knight, threatening to remove the defender of the white pawn on d4. BG5 attacks the e7 pawn and allows the white queen to defend d4. A pawn kicks the opposing bishop, forcing it to move or risk being captured. The bishop is now on a square that is more secure. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is the last book move. This misses the chance to offer an equitable exchange of pieces. It is incorrect. Recaptures. It is ideal. This moves the knight to safety. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is excellent. There was only one good move in that position. This ignores an opportunity to pin a pawn. This permits the opponent to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a mistake. A chance to advance a passed pawn towards promotion is lost in this. That falls flat. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Backs off. This poses a material threat. It is ideal. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. This prevents the opponent from being able to win material. It is best. This poses a material threat. It is incorrect. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. This prevents the adversary from gaining an advantage. It is ideal. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. This threatens to win a pawn. This prevents the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. This offers an equal trade of pieces. This threatens to double the pawns in front of the king. This stops the opponent from being able to win a pawn. 
it is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This stops the opponent from being able to double the pawns in front of the king. It is best. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. Both players navigated the middle game well.